Let's talk about eight other ways to say don't worry. We use don't worry when someone is telling us about a difficulty or a frustration. We are trying to make them feel better and comfort them. We are trying to console them. Let's see an example. Oh no! I lost my cute little doggy! Don't worry. In this situation, the lady, she lost her cute little doggy. She's probably upset and frustrated. So I'm trying to calm her down and I say, don't worry. Hmm. All right, here we go. Let's do eight other ways to say, don't worry. Number one. I can't feel my legs. It's all right. Number two. All my teeth fell out. These things happen. Number three. I cried like a baby. There, there. Number four. My armpits smell bad. Things will look up. Number five. I ran out of bullets. We'll figure this out. Number six. A tiger ate my husband. Don't let it get you down. Number seven. I broke up with my girlfriend. Wait, you have a girlfriend? Uh, I mean, things will get better. Number eight. I'm allergic to air and water. I know how you feel. Okay, so we just did eight other ways to say don't worry. So remember, keep in mind that we use don't worry when someone is telling us about a difficulty or a frustration. We're trying to make them feel better and comfort them. We're trying to console them. Okay, see you soon.